You know, it's always a good idea to run scan disk to check your computer's hard drive for errors and to scan for and attempt to recover bad sectors or areas of the hard drive so your computer can run more efficiently. You should run ScanDisk on every computer drive you have, C, D, E, F, at least once a month, or whenever you experience major problems running software on your computer. If you have a laptop, you probably just have one drive, the C drive. But if you have a PC, you might have those drives partitioned, which means you have more than one drive created out of one drive. You might have more than one drive like this, C, D, E, and F, etc. Now, it's always a good idea to run scan disk before you defrag meant your computer. Remember, scan disk before defrag every time. You'll learn more about how to defrag your computer, which means defragment your computer in an upcoming video. To run scan disk, simply open Windows Explorer by right clicking on the start button, then selecting the word explore. That will open up Windows Explorer. Right click on any one of your computer's hard drives. In this example, we'll scan the C drive. You can only scan one hard drive disk at a time. So start with C, and then do the others as time permits. Now, scroll down and choose Properties, then click on the Tools tab, then click on the Error Checking Check Down button. When you do, a box will appear with these options. Automatically fix file system errors? Yes. Scan for and attempt recovery of bad sectors? Yes. Press the Start button. Ah! Here comes a message. The disk check could not be performed because the disk check utility needs exclusive access to some Windows files on the disk. These files can be accessed only by restarting Windows. Do you want to schedule? this disk check to occur the next time you restart your computer? Absolutely, yes. At this point, it would be a good idea to close any program down that you have and restart your computer. When you do, Windows will begin a series of tests automatically. You don't need to worry or touch it. It will scan your computer for errors and fix them where and when it needs to. This can take up to 10 minutes, maybe longer, but it's so worth it. When the scanning is done, Windows will boot up like normal, and your computer will be that much more healthier. Repeat these procedures for any other drives you have on your computer and at least once a month, or when you experience problems running software programs on your computer. Congratulations! Now you can defrag your computer. Come on, I'll show you how to do that.